doesn't start to describe what Devin Booker has done, a just incredible scoring binge that he's been on over his last six. We'll get to all that here from downtown. Butler able to track it down. Rozier, the little fake, puts it down, and he's... Can they find enough balance with this offense? Because they have been top-heavy, as you alluded to at the top. It's been either Booker or Durant with Rozier coughing up a turnover. Booker guarded by Rozier. This is Nurkic. He can shoot it from the outside. Not that time. Way too much. 45 minutes, a new 30. Yeah, yeah, new 35. Yeah. You still, you, you just smack dab in the middle of your prime, my friend. <laughs> you always know what to say to make the guy feel good. Heisman <laughs> hesitation, and he puts it down. Yes, Udonis Haslam, Miami Heat royalty, kind enough to uh, give us a couple of minutes here as Bam Adebayo gets to work. And the rebound corralled underneath by you. This is obviously my most important job is trying to get these guys back on track, but being retired, I still want to have more time for the family. Mm. Nurkic able to pull the rebound and... What do you think is one of the big reasons that they just haven't seen to play with a lot of confidence offensively? Um, I think what these guys need to understand is that we're not a team that's going to throw the ball to one guy and stand around and watch. Yeah, I know Spo very well, and these are the moments when he feels most alive. You talk about a guy who's pretty much accomplished it all individually, so he's still looking to be challenged. Kick out, this is Hakez, and he coughs it up. Another heat turnover, their sixth. Beal, beautiful pass back to Okogi, and he's headed to the free throw line. Skilled enough to be able to convert there. Butler leans in. He's been really quiet so far. Greg, what have you seen from Jimmy Butler? Have to show itself here in this second half if the Heat want to get back in this. Tyler Hero on a three, missed it. That was Mickey Harrison, by the way. You're good. So the Phoenix Suns trying to get back on the winning track today, playing the fourth stop of a season-long seven-game trip. Second night of a back-to-back -back as KD hits a tough little step-back fade. Hero coughs it up. Booker the steal from his backside. And what a pass. Nurkic ahead of the field. Boy, look out. Nurkic takes a nasty spill. Boy, Dennis, that could be potentially significant blow. Just as this Phoenix team, GA, starting to get whole with Bradley Beal back. Butler. What a matchup against Beal. Leans in. A little bit of contact. Butler gets it back, and he's going to shoot free throws. Bring in a first-year coach, and the record was good, but something they felt was missing, and they ended up moving him midway through that season as well. They ended up... Tyler Hero looking to push. Miami trying to get its offense back and recalibrated. Adebayo misses again. Nurkic was there to bother the shot. What a matchup here. KD, and he coughs it up. Highsmith, the theft. Hero transition three. Not even close. The, arguably the best player on the floor is just basically spacing the floor over in the corner. That's how stacked the talent is on this Suns team. And that's a tall task against this team. Nurkic backs down, bam, up and under. Adebayo able to hold. But they have clearly had some struggles here putting the ball in the basket. Nurkic with a leaner. It would be their 27th win of the season. Beal elevates and hits. Compared to those first three quarters. Yeah, they've had stretches. You think the first half in New York on Saturday before the wheels came off. Magic are up big at halftime against the Mavericks. So that, that would be not a position you want to be in. We've seen them in the eighth spot before, but this Eastern Conference is a little bit different animal this year. And